Oh, not even with all this bandage, I can close my jeans. What can I do? It looks like there are medicines I can use. Maybe if I ask my mom for some money for books, I can buy them. Honey, look what I bought for you. Mm. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Look how pretty this is, honey. This, it's very pretty, mom. Isn't it? And I was lucky to even find one. They don't sell long dresses anymore, you know, for girls like you. Nowadays, all you find are short dresses and mini skirts. Mm, you know, generations are different now and... What do you mean different? No, Dana. It shouldn't be like that. That's why young girls act all heated and... But anyway, here, try it on. It's gonna look beautiful. Mm. Mm. Mom. The truth is, I need to confess something. What? Honey. Daughter, are you okay? What's wrong? <coughs> Dana! <coughs> Daughter, what happened? Did you vomit? I... Dada! No! Daughter! What's wrong? Daughter, what's wrong? Dana! D doctor, how is my daughter? Fine, much better. Actually, she just woke up. <sighs> Thank God. But is she sick or something? Why did she feel like that? Your daughter is not sick. Your daughter is pregnant. No. Oh, my daughter, that can be. Ma'am, calm down. Not my daughter. No, not my daughter. Ma'am, calm down. Daughter! Mom, you're pregnant! You're pregnant! For, forgive me. He told me that with one time, nothing will happen. You mean the idiot that got you pregnant? What did you do with Dana? Haven't I given you education? No! No, you haven't! I tried to tell you, but you always avoid this topic. How did you expect me to react? You're the only family I have. But I couldn't never talk to you about me. <gasps> How old I know if he was falling for me, just playing with me. Who could I tell? <laughs> if my mother never wanted to listen. <laughs> Daughter, I... I I had to do this alone. And I am very scared. Hey, ma'am. I need you to come with me. This way. Dana, wait. If you are disappointed and you want me out of the house, I will understand it. No, honey. That's precisely what your grandparents did to me. What? You're right. I was harsh and distant with you. But it's just, I also made the mistake that you're going through now. What do you mean? 
I'm 26, Dana. I also had you in my 13th. Your grandma, especially your granddad, hated me when they found out. They kicked me out. And they never spoke to me again. I tried to go with a man that was your dad and he also rejected me. I didn't want you to go through the same. That's why I started to forbid you from going out with your friends and even how you dress. I didn't want you to make the same mistake I did. Because for me, it was really hard to give you the life you have now. Especially because I was alone. I get it, Mom. I made a mistake. And now once more, but not with you. No, don't say that. It wasn't easy for you. And all you did was for my own good. And I still felt you. No, no. No, honey. We'll get out of this together. I told you the story won't repeat. And that's a promise. <sighs> Dana, are you ready to go to the doctor? Hurry! Hello, is Dana here? Who win? What are you doing here? Well, I came for you and for my son. What? You didn't show up once during her pregnancy. Not even when she was born. Yeah, it's a she, by the way. Yeah, and the truth is I didn't want to come. But my dad said I had to take responsibility, so I came here. Come on, grab your things! No, no, no! My daughter won't go anywhere. No, mom, wait. Will you give us a minute? No. You can't be thinking of living with him. Look, mom. Maybe he's a little grumpy now. But... It's because he hasn't met her daughter yet. Anna. He's an irresponsible little brat. Open your eyes. He's immature, just like I was. But I will give him the chance. He has the right to meet and love his daughter. Grab the child. I will go to get my stuff. The daughter. <sighs> well, anyway, you're gonna leave here. Very well. Let me just text my mom and send my location and tell her we have arrived. No, no, Dana. I don't want your mom being all noisy and annoying. No cell phones, okay? Come on. Hey, Owen. And why don't you help me up the stairs? Help you with what, or...? With the baby, so you can meet her. You will fall in love just by seeing her. I'll wait for you upstairs. Oh, honey. We're going to be fine. Your daddy only needs a little time to get to know you. That baby of yours won't let me sleep, and I'm tired. From now on, you'll sleep right here. But there's not even a bed in here. Well, go grab a blanket and a pillow from my bathroom, whatever. Are you really making your own daughter sleep on the floor? Even the streets, as long as it allows me to sleep. How's that sound? How dare you? <sighs> I'm stuck with your drama. I'll leave you. Today's Monday and I have soccer. But Owen... No, 
I can't anymore. This is enough. I want to be a good mother. A strong and capable one, like my mom was with me. We are leaving this place, honey. Why does my mom doesn't answer? I'm sure it's because she's very upset with me. <gasps> Darling! Mom! You came back! Mom! I thought you were mad at me. Of course not, sweetheart. There's no way. I looked for you day and night. I didn't know where you were. You didn't answer your phone. I miss you so much. And my grandbaby. Being a mother is hard. We must lose fear of getting close to our children. We need to educate them with a proper conversation according to their age. They'll mature until they get the information they need. <laughs>